What is going on guys? Evergreen Motor Works back again today. We got another episode with the Miata. Um, so I wasn't able to get you guys a video for a sway bar. We kind of didn't even really film that much. And um, I couldn't really throw that video together because there was nothing really even filmed. But today we got something really special. It's kind of like a non-fit um, uh, piece, which I'm not going to tell you right now. But... Um, it's a non-fit piece, so I'm going to make it universally fit. Uh, but anyways, today we got best choice products. Um, and it is a roof rack for a, a Miata. Who has ever seen a Miata with a roof rack? Nobody. Uh, so I thought it'd be a little bit different. And I'm going to try to retrofit it onto the car. These guys didn't really send any instructions. I kind of got one assembled right now, but I'm trying to figure out how the latches actually work because it's a little confusing. But uh, yeah, let's get to it. All right, so I mocked up like, because they didn't send instructions. So I have to mock up like a version of how, like the most um, like stable way to build it because this latches under the hard top and then you got your pull tab to tighten it down and this kind of just loops through like the foot I guess is what you would call it for at least a rack uh, they're called foots but so I mocked up one way that's already on the vehicle and I just mocked up this way because it seems a little bit stronger as opposed to the one that I got over here but um I mocked up this one it's kind of like it's a lot more like non-stable looking like this latch sits right here and it seems like if you just pulled it it would loosen up and this goes on the back side like that but i'm super pumped right now um i think what i gotta do for the rear ones is like pinch this a little bit more so it clamps down better on the hard top um i'm so pumped though i don't know why because i've never seen a miata with a roof rack on it besides henry's but at the time, I think I told him it looked stupid. So, kind of got butt hurt and uh, thought it looked cool. So, I wanted to do my own, but whatever. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get back to um, trying to figure out a more stable way to hold it up on the hard top so it doesn't fly off when I'm driving and kill somebody. All right, guys. So, I'm not quite done yet. Um, it's kind of frustrating because I don't know I don't really have two people to do it but that's what it looks like it looks pretty badass I mean I don't plan on putting anything on it it's kind of more or less for just style but um I think it honestly looks pretty badass for a Miata like like I've been saying like I've never really seen a Miata with a roof rack on it and it kind of looks badass like all right guys that's the end of this video um just to conclude it real quick, so what I did was I wrapped it a certain way and then all the ex the excess I wrapped around the buckle so it wouldn't come loose and then kind of ghetto but I zip tied it. You won't be able to tell from afar. Same with all around. And um, I think the last thing that I got to do and I'm going to get ready to go do right now is, um, so see these are kind of easy to pull off. Like, let me see if I can get it off. There we go. I think I'm gonna, I, for some fucking reason, I don't have any, like, heavy duty channel locks, so, like, I'm gonna squeeze this bitch a little bit more, get some better grip on the hard top, but, like, it's, seriously, like, I'm, I'm moving the car right now, and the rear's not coming, same with the top, a or the front a little bit, but, Still a little sketchy, so just for extra safety, I'm going to clamp those down a little bit more and then hopefully get a little bit tighter on there. But um, pretty sweet-ass universal roof rack. Uh, it has settings, so like if you want to bring the foot package out a little bit more or whatever, uh, I think it just looks better on the closest setting in. That way it kind of has some excess sticking off for the smaller top like this car it's not really even designed for this car like i said it's a universal fit it's got like um these little rubber pads so like you know it doesn't fucking scar up and uh, just try to get it adjusted as best as you can if you do go do go to do it on a miata um 
just try to get it fit as best you can I mean it's pretty solid like I told you like it moves a little bit it's because it's wet underneath but it's solid as fuck it looks sick as fuck in my opinion you don't see a lot of roadsters or Miatas or whatever you want to call it that have a roof rack and the insulation is pretty easy for what it is um, I'm pretty psyched about it I said it a hundred times but uh yeah, I'm going to go grab some channel locks, clamp these down a little bit, hopefully get a better um, um, tightness on it. And um, that's going to do it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm fucking psyched. Uh, installation wasn't too bad. I'll put the link in the description to these bars. Uh, if you guys do have a Miata and want to throw them on, I got them off Amazon for like 45 bucks, so it's totally worth it if you, know, if you like the way it looks. But... Thanks for watching guys, stay tuned for more videos, peace.